Oh my god, these are dead. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something bad features. You'll find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to meet her. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Ashley, and today we're gonna be going into another dressing room. You guys have been loving these videos on my channel, so I decided to do one that you guys highly request. Like every time I ask for recommendations on like literally anything, you guys are like, "Go to Torrid. Go to Torrid. Try this from Torrid." Um, honestly, I've never owned anything from Torrid. I've never shopped at a Torrid, and that's mostly because they're from size. I want to say they're from size 10 to like. 20 something. I'm obviously a size 12 generally, but I don't know. Like for some reason, I feel like the clothes might be a little too big just because I'm kind of like in that in between range where I'm like smallest size of plus size, biggest size of straight sizing, a very mid sized body somewhere right smack in the middle. So I'm interested to see if things will fit me at Torrid. I'm sure something will fit me. Like I'm not like, oh my God, I'm so skinny. Like nothing's gonna fit me at Torrid. Like no, I've just never shopped here before. So I don't really know how their sizing goes. In my experience, a lot of plus size ranges tend to be bigger than straight size ranges like even at forever 21 like the largest size in their straight sizing selection is too small for me but the f if i just go to that first size of plus size it's like entirely too big like swimming in it so i don't know what we're gonna see but you guys always recommend toward jeans toward bras so i'm super excited to be here i'm sorry if you can hear some jackhammering in the background of course somebody is not only pulling up next to me but also Bro, you almost hit my car. But yeah, they're doing construction literally right in front of Torrid. So there was really no avoiding this. I could have went to the other side of the parking lot and filmed this part, but like, is that necessary? I will just try to edit the audio when I edit this. Give this video a thumbs up if you are a Torrid fan. Make sure you hit the subscribe button before you head on out. Make sure you watch the whole video too. Like really would love if you just watch the whole thing. I'm also gonna try to overcome my fear of filming in public and like actually film in the store. Let's see how I do. I love you guys the most. So excited to get this video out to you. First real video of 2020. Let's do it. Okay, first things first, jeans. We've got three three pairs of jeans. Let's try them. These are the jeggings. There's 12 short. Let's see. Why is, why is the zipper that short? <laughs> The zipper's freaking me out. Okay. These fit pretty well. Oh, fake pockets. I hate that. I hate fake pockets. The zipper's really weird. They fit my butt really good. Could be a little bit higher. Kind of hate this. Kind of hate the three buttons, not gonna lie. But FUPA? Kind of FUPA concealing. Can't lie. A 12 short is definitely the perfect length. Love that. Okay, all in all, like a 3 out of 5. Or, let's go to 10. Maybe like a 6 out of 10. 6 out of 10 for these guys. Oh my god, these are dead. Okay. okay, these are the bombshell skinny. They have real pockets. Still have that super short zipper. They have like elastic waistband. These are a 12 and they're very, very tight. I would definitely have to go up to a 14, but to be honest, I don't really like them anyway. Like the rips are nice, the wash is nice, but it's not high-waisted enough. It's just not very flattering. The other ones were more flattering. Hate this stitching here. Just, it doesn't really, sh well, actually my butt looks pretty big, but I don't know. I just don't like this. I feel like I look like a Sasquatch. I don't know. And these legs are so extremely tight right now. Like, it was like putting on a sausage skin. So, I don't know. These are all a miss, too. Not really what I expected. I was expecting more. Okay, last pair of jeans. These are the, where are they? The sky high skinny. So, these are supposed to be super high rise. It says 12. Let's see. Okay. These are much better. These I actually really like. I'm out of breath from jumping in them because one thing I appreciate is that the leg is actually super skinny. So like 
actually hugs the ankle down there. They're actually a good level of high rise. They have a normal size zipper, which I enjoy. Honestly, I think they look really good. But looks good. I like these. Okay, then I found these nice, at least the cheetah pants. You know, I can't say no to cheetah, so let's try them on. Okay, they fit really good, but I don't really know if I like them. I feel like I'm swimming in a cheetah print tent. I feel like kind of like this rug down here. So I don't know if I would buy them, but they do fit. And these are a size, I want to say double zero. I feel a little chunky right here. I don't know if these are very flattering on me. But they would be kind of cute. I don't know. I don't really like them, to be honest. Okay, I got this. I picked up this little one-piece jumpsuit. And it actually has a hood. And I actually really, really like this. This is super cute, super comfy. Fits me great, actually. This is a size double zero. I actually might pick this up, depending on the price but fits me great feel great in it super comfy this is something I would like fly in you know super cute okay this is actually super cute I think I would go a size up though just so it could have more of like an oversized feel but it's this really cute gray and gold like cheetah print on sweater and the gold is like metallic maybe like tucked a little French tuck action you guys this might be the most fitting bra I've ever had but like this fits me so perfectly this is the 38b the size I always thought I was but nobody ever offers so I have to go to another size also don't mind admit this I burnt myself cooking don't ask me how there but I did like other than this right here this thing is perfect okay once again 38b is my bra size I've been telling everybody for years, but nobody offers it. Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> okay, you guys, I'm back inside the car. I only ended up purchasing two things. I ended up getting those, um, what are they called? The Scott Mile High, Sky High, the highest rise jeans, the one that I said I liked in the fitting room, and then also that beige bra because honestly best bra that's fit me in a very long time so I needed it and you guys were definitely right when you said that Torrid has the best bras ever because I'm like so shocked like there was a very slim selection for the 38b size there was a lot of 38 C's but those looked like they were going to be too big for me 38b ended up fitting me perfectly but I think I'm going to go online and check out what other bras they have on there also I ended up spending $107 so like $80 for those jeans is a lot I might return them, I'm not gonna lie to you. I just felt really, really bad trying on all those clothes, leaving them all in the fitting room and like not buying anything. So I ended up buying the jeans and the bra. I might return the jeans, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like $80 for a pair of jeans that I wasn't like completely in love with, I might return them. Also, I have to say, I thought I was gonna find more stuff that fit my style in Torrid. I honestly didn't really know what like the whole vibe was of Torrid clothes. Cause I, like I said, this is my first time ever shopping there. I've seen like people I follow on Instagram, people I follow on YouTube, like wear Torrid stuff and look super cute. But when I walked in, I scoured the whole store. So I looked through everything. It might be this location that just like doesn't have very good, a very good selection, but it kind of seemed like very old lady-ish. And like, I don't want you guys to take this the wrong way, but like, it seemed like very plus size clothing. Like, do you know how like plus size clothing, a lot of the time it's made to like hide curves Hide, like very like peplum like flowy things around your stomach like stuff that isn't actually very flattering to bigger bodies I just didn't vibe with a lot of the stuff in there I thought I was gonna find way more stuff to try on but really I was just looking for stuff that I like because I'm not about to just try on stuff to try like obviously we were kind of just trying on stuff to try on stuff but I'm not gonna try on so something I don't like you know especially because I know a lot of you guys have similar style to me I just didn't really like anything in there even the fact that the jeans had like the three buttons and the teeny tiny zipper I wonder like what the thinking is behind that because you guys know I love to tuck basically all of my shirts into into my jeans I would never tuck my shirt into a pair of jeans that had three buttons and a minuscule zipper like I feel like it would just look weird not like even though I bought two things I'm not completely sold on Torrid I feel bad about it why do I feel bad about it I don't know you guys have been like hyping up Torrid so much for me but I honestly just think it's like the store just doesn't appeal to my style this was fun either way I'm glad that I like actually got to talk in the dressing room I definitely was being loud I was the only one I was the literal only person shopping in that store so it was a kind of awkward because any talking like I was trying to talk like below the music which isn't very good for my video but was good in the sense of like hiding the fact that I was talking to myself in a dressing room I will say also Torrid is very expensive 
$80 for a pair of jeans. And then the bra was like 20 something and that was half off. So it was like a four, I mean, that's a pretty standard price for a bra, but like $80 jeans and they weren't even like the best quality. They're just expensive in there. And even that jumpsuit, I was gonna get it. And then I put it back because it was like $75 for a cotton knit jumpsuit. I feel like I can get that same exact thing at Forever 21 for like 25. I guess that also says something about the fact that like people hike up the price for plus size clothing, which isn't very fair, you know? Let me know down in the comments what your thoughts on Torrid are. Should I give it another chance? Should I try out another location? Maybe this one was just like geared more towards like an older crowd because of the demographic in this town. Maybe I should try another Torrid. Maybe I should shop online. Let me know. I'm willing to give it another chance, but I'm honestly not very impressed this time. I also will say, I forgot to say this, the jeans fit tighter than I thought. I thought they were gonna run a little big. They actually ran smaller because for instance, the jeans I'm wearing right now are a size 31 from H&M, like straight sizing, and they're like loose on me. And then like all the size 12s in there were like super tight on me. So I'm very confused about the sizing. I'm rambling now, but anyway, let me know down in the comments if I should give Tord another chance. I'm, de I'm definitely willing to because I feel like they deserve it. This store just didn't give it to me. Maybe it's the selection they have out right now. I don't know. Let me know. I'm going to check them out online too to see if I find anything else I like. Also to see if they have better sales because it's pretty expensive in there. But yeah, make sure you subscribe before you head on out. I love you all so much and I will see you in my next video.